I don't know really how to start this off because this is kind of another rumor that comes out of the Hollywood Hills or something or apparently this reporter has got on good authorization or from a very good source that Ben Affleck will no longer be playing Batman or has given up the role or doesn't want to be him or whatnot because of what the fans say. Now I talked about giving people a chance in my previous video, um, link down below or click somewhere around here. And what makes me sad is the fact is people don't give this person a chance. And you kind of think that when taking on this role of Batman and of whatever character you want to take um, or anything like that, you'd kind of think people would give it with a pinch of salt. Now, one thing that annoys me is I can, well, it doesn't annoy me, but it does and it doesn't. The fact is that, yes, when you have fans and you have people who want it and people who like this sort of thing, they turn around and they don't like it. They instantly go, oh my God, I hate this person. How dare they cast X person in X film or TV show or whatnot. And they don't give a chance because at the end of the day, it's announced. It said, oh, we are putting say Ben Affleck in as Batman, he has got the role and then all of a sudden every single fan person just turns around and goes, I hate him, I don't want him to play Batman, he's ruining my childhood. Now I don't know if this is about say the people who like uh, Christian Bale or anything like that and I didn't, to be honest, I'm going to throw this out there, I didn't see him as Batman. I didn't even see him as Bruce Wayne, I just saw him, I don't know, he just, to me he didn't have the characteristics or anything to be Batman and that voice annoyed me. But when I saw a picture of Ben Affleck as Bruce Wayne, I thought wow, you know finally they've got something good and they've got a person that looks like Bruce Wayne because I, when I used to watch the old cartoon animated series, when I've watched seen it in comic books, when I, when I see that big chin and that broad masculine body of coolness, um, I see, that's how I see Bruce Wayne. I, you know, when Christian Bale came in, I, he just didn't have the build, he didn't have anything to me. But then again, people probably would have said that exactly the same as when he came out and said, well, do you know what, I don't actually see Christian Bale as Batman, I think he would not do it properly. And, uh, and this annoys me because people aren't giving Ben a chance because he could be the best Batman out there. You know, look back at all the other Batmans. I can't name them off the top of my head. But the thing is, why are, why are people not doing this? Why aren't people turning around and saying, hey, we'll give him a chance. He might be a good Batman. At the end of the day, they can always recast when they make another film or whatnot. It's one of those things. It's not set in stone like you see that person is Batman. The only person that I actually see as Batman is Kevin Conroy. That's the only Batman I see. All the rest, all the actors, I'm sorry but you have nothing on Kevin because I see him as Batman. Now he is the voice and that's how I've always pictured Batman but one thing that makes me kind of sad about this right now is that if someone doesn't like something they go straight to the internet and they voice their opinion. Now everyone is entitled to their opinion as I've said but it just it just seems that as soon as like they don't like one particular thing, they instantly throw out, Oh my god, this film is ruined! Oh my god, this film will suck! Oh my god, this film is dead! And uh, why don't, what, happened to the, what happened to the point of giving people a chance? I mean, as I said previously, look at um, in other videos, look at the people when they turned around and said that Robbie Downey Jr. couldn't play um, Iron Man. They said that he would ruin it. They said they would, he would not be the best character. They wanted other people. And then he is the best, he is literally, he is Tony Stark. Same with Heath Ledger. They turn around and they say, he could never pull off the Joker. Oh my God, he is the wrong child. I hate him, rah, rah, rah. Perfect role. It just, it just seems that as soon as a name is dropped and people don't like it, they instantly go, I hate this, off it, do not care, best, worst choice ever. And then they just slate it and to be honest, it just, it ruins it. And these are all rumours, this is something that has not been put in stone, but again, knowing what happens when these rumours come out, they're normally true. So I would quite like to see a tweet from Ben Affleck or from Warner Brothers saying Ben Affleck is still going to be Batman. So anyway guys, let me know your thoughts down below. I could rant on about a lot, but I won't. So let me know down below in the comments what do you think. Do you think this rumour is uh, true or do you think it's false? Anyway guys, if you've liked the video, like, favourite and subscribe and I'll see you in a bit.